faster than you twice. Okay, these are really cool competitive drills. Oh yeah. You wouldn't believe how many kids they just don't want to do those drills. Something that needs to be taught to uh, even younger players is being able to play with contact, play through contact, being able to initiate the contact and take contact. And that's exactly what we were uh, talking about today. My name is Patrick Janiszewski, this is Coach Free Basketball. Let's get going. I've got Michael here helping me today uh, and we'll show you a set of a few contact drills that you should be doing at home or in the practice every single time, okay? We're gonna start simple, we're just gonna go with machine gun dribbles, okay? I'm going to be dribbling with my right hand as Michael's dribbling with his left hand. All we're gonna be doing is we'll be just pushing at each other while dribbling the ball, okay? It seems pretty simple, but it's really a great way to get used to playing with contact, playing through contact, being able to hit, being able to take the hit, okay? So let's go right hand machine gun. We just go shoulder to shoulder, uh, hip to hip, okay? We wanna maintain that uh, uh, solid uh, contact throughout the whole drill. We're gonna go for four seconds, okay? Michael, let's go right hand dribble or outside. Uh, uh, you go left hand, I go right hand, okay? Let's go. Four, three, two, one. Right on, that's like the basic way for us to get used to contact. You wouldn't believe how many kids they just don't wanna do those drills because they don't wanna get hit, they don't wanna go you know, sweat to sweat, yet honestly, or uh, unfortunately, basketball is, a uh, big part of basketball is being able to, again, hit, take hit, give hits, pull shirts, throw elbows. That's the fun of it, okay? Let's go, you go uh, right hand, I go left hand. All right, let's go, ah, push, four, three, two, <laughs> one, okay? That's our drill number one. Our drill number two, we're gonna go back to back, okay? So you go right hand, I go right hand. We go back to back, butt to butt, all right? So we try to push each other out. Let's go three seconds, go. Three, two, one, good. I go left, you go left, let's go. These are really fun, man. Three, two, one, perfect. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go side to side. We're gonna go back to back. We're gonna go side to side, okay? Our goal now is to not only play with contact, but also maintain contact. Maintaining contact is super important as we're driving to the basket, because the second I lose contact, if he was playing defense on me, he's gonna cut me off, right? So not only initiating contact, but maintaining it is very important. Okay, Michael, so we're gonna go side to side. We go back to back. We go side to side, back to back, and side to side. Make sense? All right, let's go. Three, there you go, keep going. Nice, nice, good. All right. Whew, these are fun, man. So much stronger than you. Okay, so these are our basic stationary drills. Okay, now as we get warmed up, we're used to pounding the other person. We can move on to a little more game-like game situation drills. Okay, we're going to go from the top of the key now. Uh, Michael and I are gonna go shoulder to shoulder, okay? Let's go to the top of the key. We're going shoulder to shoulder, okay? The person on the right side, each time, is the pacemaker, okay? So when I go, you go, right? My goal after I detach is to get to the basket, make my layup before you take your one dribble pull up. Make sense? Questions, no questions? Awesome, Michael, let's go. I beat you. <laughs> now you go on the right side, you're the pacemaker. I'm going on the left, I gotta make my shot. Go before whenever. You go whenever, you're the pacemaker, okay? <laughs> Faster than you twice, okay? These are really cool competitive drills that uh, really, you know, make playing with contact, through contact much more fun. Let's go one more time. Let me see if I can beat you three times, man. <laughs> oh yeah. Three nothing, Michael. You owe me a coffee this morning. Okay, so this is gonna be our basic uh, contact drill, one of our basic contact drills uh, oh, that involves game situations, okay? Let's move on to the elbows, okay? Another also great drill, let's just use one basketball, okay? Now, Michael, you be the defensive player you'll be playing right on the three-point line. Alton tells on the three-point line facing the basket, okay? What the ball handler is gonna do, one foot inside the three-point line, one foot outside the three-point line. I'm going to put the ball on Michael's hip. The second I rip it, we go live. 
Make life sense? Like life 101, yeah. Like I'll beat you 101, kind of 101, okay? The second I rip it, uh, you chase me. All right, this close, Michael. Okay, so now I'm, I'm gonna play defense now. Ooh, you're gonna embarrass me. One foot inside the three-point line, one foot outside the three-point line, the defensive player, alt and toes uh, on the three-point line. Ah! Okay, nice, you're fast, man. Let's go one more time, then we're going to move on, okay? One foot inside the three-point line, one foot outside the three-point line. The second I rip, we go. Ah, you got me. Okay, let's go one more. The goal is to really get to the basket. I just wanted to kind of show off, but didn't work out. I missed my shot. Hey, nice. Right on. I don't know if you noticed, but as Michael was driving, he turned his head around to see where I was, then to figure out what kind of finish to make. Man, good job. We've got one more drill. Okay, we're gonna take a step forward. Now Michael will be playing defense. Uh, Alton tells on the three-point line. Now I'll be starting from behind Michael, all right? I'm going to put the ball on his hip. The second I put the ball on his hip, or the second I rip it, we go live, right? So the drill before, it was kind of, the ball handler had a lot of the advantage to go to the basket. It was much, much harder for the defense player to react. Now, it's even, okay? For now, I can only drive to my right, okay? I can only drive to my right. Oh yeah, that's good D, Michael. Let's go again. You can only go to the right. All right. Yes, good. What it teaches us is one, playing through contact or with contact. Two, creating the easiest angle to go to the basket, like the tightest angle to go to the basket because the second I go out this way, right? Like a lot of kids do, Michael will just cut me off right away, right? So what I have to do is I have to go as tight, as quick to the hoop as possible, right? Also, if he's chasing me, right, I have to go, if he pounds me, I just have to try to finish at the rim. I'm gonna go left. Okay, we only go left. Ah. Oh, that's a good one. Nice, that's mine's better than yours though. All right, you can only go left. Oh! There you go, finish, make it, make it, make it. Okay, and our last drill now, still gonna stay on the wing. I can go left and right, right? So we started from simple drills. Uh, then we went for a little bit harder, a little more complex. Now I've got our uh, hardest one, okay? So we go uh, defense uh, facing the uh, basket, alternate those on the three-point line, the offense ball on the hip. I can rip right or left, okay? Because this one's tough. Okay, this one's, I cannot fake though. I cannot go boom and then go the other way. So that, that's an uh, important rule. You ready? Oh, I almost got him. Michael, let's go. You can go left and right, left or right. Oh yeah. Left me way behind. He's a great offensive player. There you go. There's, uh, we just showed you a set of great decision-making, uh, contact, game like driving to the basket drills that you can do with a friend, with your dad, with your grandpa, whoever you wanna do it with. My name is Patrick Janiszewski and this is Michael, this is Coach for Basketball, we'll see you next time. <laughs>